Oh, I didn't know it was Al. They're going to say, I didn't know it was Al Pacino's birthday. Well, we know but it's we Al know Pacino's it birthday, we and know. we both love Al Pacino. So. I want to thank our big sponsor tonight, RJ's Shake Station. RJ's Shake Station. RJ's Shake Station is going to be giving us fun, healthy, and nutritious yes. treats all night long. <laughs> and I cannot wait to get a sip of that. They make and. these delicious, <laughs> delicious shakes that are, you know, also you can make your own, you can design your own ingredients and everything. But what I love about it is it's nutritious and it's responsible because we now are working with Rio Genesis yep. to provide uh, these this vax blocking powder. It's a uh, you just put a scoop in there, shake it up, and it really and helps. It, what it about stops the vax from doing what it's what they think it's going to be doing, which we don't want. What about cocktail time? Well, we do have a couple of. Uh, I, here I am, folks, at the RJ's Shake Station. Here, this is uh, a really awesome new. Uh, eating concept, a food concept that I'm excited to be a partner in. Uh, we've just sort of uh, grow, growed out of Rio Genesis, which is really, uh, you know, there were issues with Rio Genesis, and mostly it was because there was only too many, it was a little, it was spread out too thin, too many products. And what we did was rethought everything about Rio Genesis and got it back to its core values, which is protecting yourself from foreign invasion germs. And one of the greatest germs we see these days is these vaccines. And I believe they are germs. That is, the government has manifested the most powerful germs and have placed them inside little uh, uh, syringes. And they're, put, they're forcing people to take these vaccines. Actually, government's making, if you wanna work, if you wanna travel, if you wanna go to school, if you wanna even see your family, you have to take these vaccines. So now, beautifully designed, uh, Rio Genesis Vax blockers, uh, just simple powder that you can put in anything, but I like them in these shakes here. We'll get to that in a sec. But this is the good stuff. This is, get this get this sh uh, shot, get the vaccine, not have to worry about that. You take a Vax blocker, scoop a Vax blocker, and it's going to stop the vaccine from doing whatever it does in your body, installing the software, whatever it is. But it's really just powder and it's quite good on its own, but I like it actually in the shake. And I'm here with Cody. Hello. Cody Kirby. Mm -hmm. And you and actually Small World, you and uh, and our musical guest tonight, Wendy Kirby, are actually brother and sister. Indeed. That's amazing. So uh, what do we have here? Because, I mean, everyone knows what a shake is, but this is kind of a new twist on it. Yeah, actually. This is uh, hot, actually. What's yep. the, what? Well, we, we use that in our hot and hard uh, shakes that we what make. What the heck? <laughs> what is a hot and hard? So uh, we have the soup that we put in, and uh, so you can get. This is just good old-fashioned, what is this? This yeah, is just good old-fashioned chowder. Old -fashioned uh, chowder. Uh, potato chowder, yeah. And what, you put that in, a, I've never heard of that. You put that in a shake. But I love this movie. It's my, probably my favorite movie of the year so far. Uh, I'm going to give it four, um, only four and a half, five bags of popcorn to mask, and a small cup of soda. By the way, speaking of beverages, and now shout out. And now shut up. James. Big shout out to RJ's here. RJ's shake is keeping me going, it's keeping me fueled. I had a caffeine shot to this, which is almost like having a cup of coffee. What? This has now become a full-time meal replacement for me. What's in I'm it? It's, it's, just, it's just oil? This is, uh, this is the Rio, uh, one scoop of the Rio Genesis patented black uh, Vax blocker, which is, keeping, which is actually reversing some of the effects of and some earlier vaccine bags. That doesn't work. It works for all the vaccines. I've Apparently, all the inoculations I've been forced to have is, a, is a, basically since birth, it's reversing. So now all. you're suddenly going to get polio. No, I'm not getting polio. They don't pull polio. Well, if it's eradicate. reversing that, then if you were exposed to polio, this is anti-polio ele uh, elements into from natural sources. This is all natural powders uh, using lots of vitamins and minerals and uh, macro nutritional elements. So you can kind of replace all your meals with this now. I've basically been skipping breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and every once in a while I'll have, you know, a cookie or some Cheez-Its or something like that when I'm watching the game. But generally, I'm on this 24/7. And we're happy to have it. So I know you're excited about James Bond. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Tony Newman is in a facility uh, seeking treatment for her addiction to alcohol. I, I disagree with the treatment she's receiving right now. I think you could cure anything 
with the RJ's system. And we have blends that deal with uh, addictions and everything like that. So she's chosen to reject that method. Her doctor's advised against it. Um, but with that aside, I'm happy that she's going to be getting help. You, you've been taking this quite a while now. I, this is all, but Joe, I gotta get you on this. Mm, I've lost 30 that. pounds. Wow. And basically there's no solid intake in my body for the past three weeks, four weeks now. About a month, I've been existing wholly on the RJ Shake system. Ooh, you like real food? No meat and potatoes? It's just, it's just oil. It's a powder blend. It's full of organic material. Huh. Um, the reason you are here, Joe, as you know, uh, because of what's going on with Tony, I've decided to make you emergency acting vice president of the High Network. Oh, wow. And wow. so congratulations. I, I, I'm thrilled. I'm and thrilled. Thank you. Joe, check out, the, check out my new title. You have a new title. <laughs> I've got a new title too. Oh what is this? Goodness. Certificate of Expertise. This certifies that Greg Turkington. Show the camera. Has successfully completed the training program required for. What is this now? Certified Wizard of Oz um, expert. Before we do the bond, I wanted to mention some kind of good news I got yesterday. As you guys know, everybody knows I love popcorn, and I had been purchasing uh, the Pop Secret, and they had a sweepstakes that I entered. Otherwise, we're a little stagnated because Tony, you know, your, your, your wife has got a lot of information in her head that I need to get to. And I was wondering. old and new. Well, we're definitely not saying that. A uh, little. Well, you ask. All right, so quick uh, health update for, for everybody here. Uh, as everybody knows, I've been subsisting entirely on RJ's shakes now for. <laughs> Uh, about six weeks. It's been, it's been for the most part great, but it has been challenging because I have not been able to get the, the caloric intake that I need to survive as much as I was hoping I would be able to. Uh, as I've been doing uh, sometimes uh, 15 shakes a day and it, we're at like half the amount of caloric intake I need. And so, uh, as you all know, I've talked about this uh, several times, I've experienced life after death. I've passed away and come back to life a couple years ago, thank, at the hand of this guy here who poisoned us at my wedding. No, that had nothing to do with me. I've experienced the afterlife, and I am blessed to be one of the few people that has a, a gateway to the beyond through uh, meditation. And this past week, something miraculous happened. I, I was in heaven and I ran into an old friend. I ran into um, a friend that let me down, but ultimately is still a friend. And these days, my friends are in short supply. Uh, it was Dr. San. Dr. San would be in hell. Watch yourself. You know, I told him what was going on with my health and the calorie deficit that I was dealing with and we brainstormed about how to solve that problem. And that's what the good Dr. San has always been about, is problem solving. Um, what we came up with, I think is really pretty smart. We found this pretty neat solution to double my caloric intake. As you can see, it's a pretty standard feeding tube. Uh, we kind of hacked it to make it work with the RJ's shake. That's not standard. As you can see here, this is the tube in which we've inserted it into my stomach and I can add, I can add as much RJ's as I want. Was so that cold? The the it seems like if you made a shake and then you had it going into These your are the, this is the hot shake. Um, and I've got all kinds of vegetable nutrients in there and then it's just we, it drips into my stomach and now I've doubled my caloric intake for the day. And it's a really elegant solution. I think a lot of people are going to start doing this. Wouldn't it just be easier to drink more? Well, I can't just drink it. If I'm just drinking it, I'm only getting half the calories. Now I'm basically doubling up. Anyways, if you notice a little bulge here, that's what's going on. And I don't recommend it for everyone, but for me, no. it's working. And I want to thank the late, great Dr. San for being straight with me and giving me uh, some good advice. The Harder They Fall, directed by J James Samwells. Sam, James Jehems Samuel.
When an outlaw discovers his enemy is being released from prison, he reunites, reunites his gang to seek revenge. What'd you think of The Harder They Fall? Oh, that is a, uh, a reminder. I've got to do five big sips. I'm not reviewing any more movies until you agree to let me review the Bond movie. And then I'll review movies for you. And until then, I'm going on strike. Five, this is basically a great super ham, Superman movie, superhero movie, without some of the bullshit that you see in Superman heroes movies lately. I got another thing here. Hold on. All right, finally, uh, I have some news that will interest you. Somebody sent this video in. I don't know who it was. We got this in uh, the other day, and it pissed me the hell off, and I think we should show it, and we'll talk about it. It's a movie? To my stepson, Matt Newman, who I've gotten to uh, connect with, with uh, Tony in rehab. And uh, a couple weeks ago, I, we had a um, really nice dinner. I got to, I didn't, I had my shake in my bag here, and uh, he, he had some frozen pizza, and we were just getting to connect. He took his gaming headset off for a little bit, and... Uh, you know, I kind of opened up to him about uh, my past, really. And he just, you know, he kind of was in the dark on a lot of my experiences, my fir uh, first wife, Ayaka, and uh, issues we had with Dr. San and everything. And it was really nice because I think he and got I'm to offering know you me. an opportunity to expound for as long as you want. You could write a goddamn book on the blog format on High You're right, I where could. you could post your thoughts on the new fucking James Bond movie that no one cares about. Well, that's or not what the box office receipt show. You can In keep fact, this bullshit it's, going. It's been the biggest hit movie the past three weeks. All so. right. Do we have a deal? Well, let me ask you this. All right. Do you not could want I to talk both? about Ghostbusters? Could, could I do both? Do you not could want to talk the, about Ghostbusters? Could I do a, a quick, like, two-minute review oh, here? Excuse and me. Then I do, take my and steps. then do the essay as well? Could we do both? And then I'll ditch the suit for next week. And we can begin the show now. Hi everybody, my name is Tim Heidecker and this is an on cinema on the uh, at the cinema show. Fuck. I'm sorry about this. I, I now have to triple the amount of oral shake I'm doing because we have a major blockage now in the tube because of some of the thicker uh, elements of the powder yeah. uh, is now blocking and it causes an infection and now it's, a lot of the shake is not is not getting into the, where it needs to get it's we're blocked up and that's causing an infection now wow. not only in the stomach but now in the bladder so that's why we have this colostomy bag here or a, uh, whatever it's called for urine and I, which is also receiving some of the pus um, and fluids from the from the uh, infection so this, right after we wrap, I'm going to get this looked at. Yeah, have you seen um, a yeah. doctor at any point? Well, I've been communicating with one. Um, yeah. Listen, I just want to acknowledge we got Greg Turkington here, my Hey, guys, expert it's movie time. On, uh... No, no, what, what it so is. So you had an opportunity to go to the Ghostbusters premiere, and you declined that opportunity so you could take some money? What does it say about somebody that's supposed to be some kind of film buff? Excuse me. Well, LaRue has never been a good researcher, first of you all. You took the money, Here's Greg. what happened. Answer the question. I was Did offered. You choose I, between money I won, and the premiere, and you I chose the, the premiere. No, uh, money. premieres. No. You're here at the world premiere. You didn't even have to win the pop secret. Let's contest. take a look at ah, a deck of cards. This is getting some. There's Starring Joe Estevez. <clears throat> I can feel that there's. Wherever the entry point is, is not actually entering my the organ. It's sort of outside. Pull all outside of it out and put a Band-Aid over the hole. Let's take a look at Deck of Cards from Greg Turkington. I, I want to also say the reason uh, Manuel is here is because he saved my life. Uh, I was at, at the Rock House, and the feeding tube 
as you guys saw last week, was giving me a lot of trouble. There was an infection growing, and I collapsed. And Manuel took you God, to the emergency me, room. He took me to the emergency room. Uh, the, the doctor there basically said that my body, outside of my organs, was filling up with the RJ's shake. Uh, and that was causing me to go into septic shock, was what he said. So yeah, something, something about that. So they flushed me out, system. and they said never, you know, this doctor, uh, sort of traditional doctor, was very uh, disturbed with uh, the feeding tube and how I had set it up, and had it removed and sent me home with a bunch of medicine and, and antibiotics to clear out the shake from the inside. I should say it was not... It was in the inside of my body, but the outside of the organs that it should have been going to. And now I uh, have to consult, really, with my uh, with Dr. San and find out uh, some alternatives to, to supplement the calories that yeah, we're not you, getting. You can actually come to the rock house with you. Got to make something that you actually can enjoy. It's good for you. I enjoy this. I'm not saying I don't enjoy it. It's just I'm not getting enough calories from it. We have plenty of calories in the rock house. All right, well, <coughs> no one seems to understand this problem. Well, of Raccoon City has always been something that interests me. So I also give it five bags of popcorn and uh, two great movies this week. And I'm glad we got to get your insight. It's refreshing to get somebody that seems to really know Thank his you. stuff. And uh, I'll, I'll, take, I'll tell you what, I'll take you up on that offer. It, it's been, geez, six weeks or so since I've had uh, any f solid food in my mouth, and I uh, think I'm ready for uh, maybe some of your carbonara or some of your m meatballs or meatballs. whatever it is. And no, it's no, no knock on RJ's. I just think everything, you know, one of the things I try to do in life is live every day in moderation and a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And I think it's a great lesson learned is, uh, you know, sometimes you got to sit down and just have a nice big meal that your friend makes for you. So uh, I'll take you up on that I'm in offer. a great mood. I had a really beautiful, moving meditation uh, and a consultation with my uh, guardian angel, Dr. San, last night, who owned up uh, to the fact that the feeding tube might have been too much. And I just feel blessed that I have this guardian angel looking over me and helping me through all of life's trials and tribulations. So I'm. I'm just in a great mood. Um, some actually exciting news later in the show as well. That, Let's uh, do the reviews. I'm also here with the star of Mark's Cavalcade of Characters premiering tonight on the High Network, Mark Port, uh, Post, Mark Pro, Scort. Mark, Mike, Mark, Court, uh, Mark Pro. So how do you do, how do, you do that, Mark? Prox. There you go.